you know, <clears throat> I try and figure these things out, and it realize it comes to me after you sit there and you play the level once that you never really did check everything in the area. So to get the last amber, since I'm at the end of the level, I told you guys I would beat the level again and get it all 100%. To get the last amber, there's either one hidden everywhere, or you can smash the little white larvas that you come across, and they'll drop, sometimes randomly drop one. So with that, I've collected everything. Now, let's have our pun for the day. If I can possibly come up with one. Yeah, I'm not coming up with one. Welcome back to another Let's Play Medieval. Okay, the one thing I also wanted to bring up to you guys. There might be a few changes. One, I fully repaired my shield and uh, sat there and bought upgraded everything. Well, not upgraded. I just sat there and bought ammo for everything, so it's all maxed out, except for the spears. Come to find out, 25 spears is all you need to kill the Ant Queen. That's all it took. Now, let's get out of here. And let's see what our reward is from Madam Witch. Now, the chicken drumstick is actually pretty useful, especially if you need health in a pinch. The chicken drumstick, when thrown, will actually turn most enemies in the level into whole chickens, which heal you for maybe 30 or 40 points. That I'm not entirely sure about either. I'm just taking a wild stab in the dark here. All right, now that we did that, back into the enchanted forest so that we can actually take the proper way out. But let's test out this chicken. That did not work. Okay, I forget how the chicken works. I'm gonna get probably get killed doing this. Yeah, I don't remember how it works. So, let's just uh, get going with this level here. Yeah, I had to repair my shield, because if I wouldn't have repaired my shield, it would have actually been destroyed while I was off screen. Okay, let's head over this way. Now, see, if we would have actually came here earlier, we wouldn't have been able to do much other than that quest. That's because of uh, not being able to get the Earth Ruin. But now that we have certain items, which I will, we will be using here. If I could kill this stupid frog, there we go. Okay, let's heal up. I lost a life bottle while I was down there throwing spears at the ant queen. But yeah, you can tell that my money has taken a significant decrease because I sat there and just stocked up on everything for the hell of it. The one thing I didn't do was enchant my sword, which I probably should have done, but that'll be happening later. Let's just ride this thing up. Be gentle. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Yeah, if you fall from here, yeah, you're gonna die, so please do not attempt to try and jump this. There we go. I figured I'll kill you guys, because my luck will be you'll knock me off, or I'll knock myself off, whichever one. Get bent! Yep. Okay. Slowly. Alright, now this is one where you gotta ow. Be careful, because that bird will come back to haunt you. You can kind of hear it coming with the flap of its wings. 
Just push these off. One of these has what we want. There we go. Come on. Now I got a copper shield, not what I wanted. This one should be it. There it is, the Earth Ruin. Alright. Yeah, we could come here and get the Earth Ruin and go into the next area, but it's the fact of the matter that without a certain item, we wouldn't have been able to move on. Now, see, this is the part where I would normally just walk straight forward and fall down, but it's also a deal where if I do that, I'm going to take a lot of damage, but what the hell? Oh, I didn't take as any damage. I thought I was going to take some. Fine. Prove me wrong, game. Prove me wrong. <laughs> Alright, now that we're back into the infested swamp area, we're going to put this here. We're going to kill you because I don't like you. I don't like you either. Alright, what's this book got to say? Aha! Tomb of the Shadow Demons. Now see, if we actually head this way... We would need the shadow artifact here in a little bit. And since we took the other path the first time, we don't have to worry about it. None shall enter. The shadow demons are entombed within, separated from the world of goodness and light until the earth cracks open. No one, not even the Dark Lord Zarek, can release them without the shadow artifact. Leave now. Well, we just so happen to have this so-called shadow artifact, thanks to going through the other area. So after I collect my money here, alright, let's use it. Down we go. Alright. Now let's see here. So, I got a question. How'd you know I was going to be down here? How do you know I'm not like Sir Danielle or something like that? Or Madam Danielle? How do you know? There's the chalice. Okay. So... Guess you just gotta walk on them all. Yeah, no. So, I need to... Wait a minute. I forget how this puzzle... What in the world is that? Oh, that's the artifact, okay. So let's see here. Maybe if I go this way. Okay, fine. What if I crisscross these? Negatory. Um, see, this is the one thing that annoys me. I don't really have a clue of how to... They don't give you a clue of how to figure this out. Besides this. <sighs> You're a game... You're a jerk, game. You're a jerk. Yeah, this doesn't even give you a clue. Can I go back up? No, I can't. I'm stuck down here now until I figure this out. Huzzah! Alright, I'm an idiot. Um, do I not have anything that tells me otherwise? Yeah, figures. Fire... Let's just run in circles. Open, damn it! Um. Wait, Earth? Why do these look like. Uh, earth, wind, fire. I'm guessing Earth, wind, fire, and water. So, what if I start from here and go like this? Okay, fine. What if I start here and do this? I will figure this out if I gotta run in circles. <laughs> in fact, I actually might cut this out. Until I'm smart enough to figure this out. Oops. 
Yeah, you're gonna be a douche about this, aren't you, game? Why do I feel like an idiot? Like, this is really easy to solve. I do. I, I, I feel like the answer is just looking me straight in the face and I'm being a total frickin' moron. Wait a minute. Oh, I've already used it. I thought maybe I had it still. Um, what if I throw a th a chub? What if I throw a chicken drumstick at it? I could kill myself. I really could. Just like that, we've done a bad thing. Can I jump down in there? No. Alright, for that we get the Shadow Talisman, but we've also made a very bad move. With that, we have released the Shadow Demons. These guys aren't exactly fun to deal with. Again, the shadow demons are wreaking havoc across the land, and it's all thanks to you. Thank you. The single most destructive and wretched creatures in the history of the world, and you've given them an early parole. They will be heading for the ruins of King Peregrine's castle. Galamir is doomed. Nah. Sir Daniel Fortescue is here to save everybody, even though I am the one that's wrought this upon thee. Would you just die? This is why. This is where things are going to start getting annoying. Okay, well, there's the exit. And as you can see, we're now starting to collect souls. I think I'm actually going to pop over to the flaming longbow here. Just to do a little extra damage. Oh, there we go. One, to keep them away, and two, to do extra damage. Because when on fire, they do take extra damage. Yep, 29% so far. Whoa, 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 whoa. Back it up, sir. Get bent. Uh, damn you, Persona 4. I hate you, Kanji. I hate you. Alright. Whoa, that's the way. That's not the way out, but that's the way I came in. Now, wait a minute. Come on, camera. Aha. Now that uh, now that we've released the shadow demons, a lot of the gates have opened up. I just wish the camera would cooperate. Okay, that should kill him. If I just let him sit and suffer. Ow, 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 ow. Burn. Bastard. I never did read this book. I never did read this book. Uh, yeah, that was about the dragon bird that we saw earlier. Alright, how many souls do we have? 52. Okay, this is a pointless endeavor for now. I don't think I can go up here. Ow. Yeah, I didn't think so. That's something for later, I believe. Let's go back through here. Ha! Ha! You're dead. Hmm. 
You're dead and I enjoy it. Okay, seriously? Oh, I can't go that way anyway. Alright, let's go back down here. I feel like I'm missing something besides the Chalice of Souls. Oh, I know what, I'm frickin'... wait a minute. I was going the right way. I just did the wrong thing. Okay. Come on, Fortis Q. Didn't I kill you? Here it is. This is where I went wrong. I was supposed to stick the talisman in here. There we go. Now I can walk through. This is the area... This is the one thing I hate. This fight here is annoying. You have the enemies here that fly around on the outside. What's worse about it... They'll do it. I don't know if they will. You bastard. No, Fortress Q, put your arm away. That's one thing they do. They try and chuck you down into the abyss below. And it sometimes works. That's the annoying part. Oh, no, 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 no. All you gotta do is just survive the attacks. That's all this is. And just pray to God that you don't get knocked into the area below. When they do the meteor attack here, that is your best chance to kill them. They also give a lot of souls for killing them, so hopefully you can get all your souls here. There we go. Now, once they're dead, the platform rises for you to get off over here. It also has two two uh why did I forget the name all of a sudden? Fountains of Rejuvenation. That's it. It has two of them in case you did take a beating from these guys. So do not be afraid well, be afraid about losing every ounce of your life bottles and all your health and dying. But don't be afraid about not being able to refill them. Because not only do they give them, give you that, but they also give you money, and if I th remember correctly, they also give you a few energy vials. There we go. Alright, back to my broadsword and golden shield. I am a knight, and I'm going to probably fall. There we go. Just in case you didn't have enough energy. Hop down here. We have the... We now have the... Star Ruin, so we can get out of here now. But not without... Getting... The Chalice. So now we need to head back over here. Avoid them. Head down here. Hoppity hop, hop, hop. Down we go. Don't know how I did that in one try. I'm actually rather impressed. Grab the chalice. And out the door. There we go. I took a Yui. There we go. See ya! <laughs> and there we go. There's the real exit to the Enchanted Earth. Also... On to the Hall of Heroes! I want to check my statue. Yep, still slowly coming. Okay, nobody needs me, thank god. Can I take this yet? I want it. Fine, I don't want it. Alright, who can do what for me this time? Okay, not you. I could talk to you. You're done, from what I know. You are too, and you are too. Looks like Bless You has something for us. Blood Month or something like that. Ten thousand courses for this guy. I bet money you be back pushing all daisies by now. Hey, I have something here for you. You like it very much? You want? <laughs> And with that, more money. 
Hooray. All right. And with that, this one level has gone on far longer than it should have because of one dumb puzzle. So next time, everybody, we will... be moving on to one of my most hated levels of all time. The Pools of the Ancient Dead. I'll catch you guys later.